this session entitled Senescence, Senolytics, and Pulmonary Fibrosis really sprung out of the genetic work in which multiple different genes that are all in the same pathway leading to telomere shortening have been discovered in patients with pulmonary fibrosis. And those genes in that pathway implicates um, basically a role for faster aging in patients that develop the disease pulmonary fibrosis. So senescence is the study of how cells age and how organisms, including humans, age appropriately. And pulmonary fibrosis is basically an age-related disease in which the lung is aging much faster than we would expect it to age based on the patient's chronologic age. And so there's a new development now in pulmonary fibrosis to have a better understanding of the aging process in the lung and why it leads to scarring and why it leads to other types of lung disease. And so that based on the basic science of senescence or, or programmed aging, there are some therapies that work in mice and other um, organisms to delay that process of aging. And so they're using those medications now to see whether or not they would have any effect in people with pulmonary fibrosis. And so one of the topics that was discussed is a new clinical trial that's still ongoing. We don't have the final results yet about whether or not patients with this disease would have any benefit for those medications that are specifically called senolytics to tone down, damper, get rid of this, these cells that are abnormally aged. So I think that uh, with uh, senescence, um, many of us as clinicians always thought that once the cell actually died, that nothing further needed to be happening. But what we found out in lots of the research studies that have been recently done is that the senesce cell actually continues to release very harmful uh, substances to the surrounding cells, which then promote what we think uh, would be the fibrotic process. So with the studies, they're looking at ways uh, in which to kind of manage the senesce cells and to possibly um, uh, have mediators in which we can um, actually get rid of the senesce cells instead of leaving them there and, went and stop the harmful um, process that they continue to emit. Senesce was once thought to be um, a biologic process where um, cells just became old and they stopped functioning. But now we know that that's not exactly correct. So there's a very specific genetic program that's activated in senescent cells. They have um, specific cytokines that they release. And uh, there's a hypothesis that cellular senescence is one of the um, factors that's driving fibrosis and fibrotic interstitial lung disease. So um, a pilot study has been performed um, in patients using uh, medications that um, are thought to be senolytic. So in other words, they would drive the cells um, away from the um, senescence um, gene expression program um, back towards normal. And um, in this pilot study, it was shown that these senolytic drugs are um, relatively safe and well tolerated when taken over a short time period. So that's the initial step um, before a larger clinical trial can be done to measure their efficacy.